looked at everything and all was in order as they look to continue their impressive start to the season and to their new chapter as Dembele quickly opening his box of tricks on the left-hand side. Coming forward, uh, Suriki Dembele into the penalty area. Scott Hogan, only chance for Blues. Hogan sends his header over the crossbar, but immediately we see the danger that Suriki Dembele possesses. Dickey carrying it forward for Bristol C. Just on the periphery of the Blues' final third. Works it out to the left-hand side for Pring. Pring for Mimetti. It's cut back inside the penalty area, picked up by Cornick. Scrambled to safety by Bielik. Buchanan, now Sonic can race forward for Blues. Drops one in for Keshi Anderson. Anderson on the periphery of the penalty area. Lays it off for Bakuna. Touches onto his left foot. Bakuna strikes for goal. Tame effort in the end. Plays by Dembele. Checks inside on his left foot. And Dembele makes the intervention and comes away with the ball. Hogan is the furthest forward for Blues on the halfway line. And lose the challenge of Tanner. Bursting now down the left-hand side. Bakuna's made the run outside him. Here he is towards the byline. Junior Bakuna. Round Williams he goes. Bakuna right footed effort towards goal. Straight down the throat of Max O'Leary. Faced by a, a blue line of three. And it's Sonic with the intervention. And now Dembele slots it through for Keshi Anderson. Inside the penalty area. Sets up Scott Hogan. Defected. Comes from Miyoshi off the line by Bristol City. And turn behind for a corner kick. Miyoshi. Inches away from his first Blues goal. Ball back. Daily. Blues ending the half strong. Anderson into the middle. Miyoshi fires Blues into the lead. And what a way to score your first Blues goal. Ashton Gate is breached. Koji Miyoshi with an explosive finish at the end of the first half. What an excellent fit finish by Miyoshi there. Just as Bristol City were up in the tempo. Blues. Just then, um, quick counter-attack, create a series of chances. Then just off this corner, Miyoshi popping up in the right place at the right time. And what fantastic technique. Unstoppable. It's a venomous drive into the roof of the net from Koji Miyoshi. His first Blues goal, and what a firecracker it is. Absolutely no chance for Max O'Leary in the Bristol City net. And Blues will head into the half-time changing rooms, one up. You can just see Miyoshi's movement. He doesn't go into the pack of players. He doesn't want to be surrounded. He's not going to win a header. He pulls away, just creates enough space, and it drops perfectly for him. And there, the end product is a ball in the roof of the net. Now Buchanan and Bielik turns away from Knight. Looks to feed Bakuna. It'll come for James, who's continued his run down the right-hand side. Is Jordan James. Options in the middle. Fired across the six-yard box, but gathered by Max O'Leary. Bakuna picks up the loose ball in the middle and the turf just opens up in front of him. Bakuna goes alone, still going Bakuna, edge of the penalty air, fires towards goal, inches wide. Inches wide from Janino Bakuna, could only have been a hair length in it. It's great skill um, by Bakuna there again, but there's, there's big areas in the centre of the pitch where people are vacated to go and attack, but Bakuna will exploit that. From the home and the away crowd, respectively, as he makes his way over to take this corner kick. Short it goes to Anderson. Back to Miyoshi. Checks in to his right foot, delivers. James was there. It might come for Buchanan to hit it. Deflected. And James was there to stab it goalwards. But O'Leary in the way. Naismith sends it long and diagonal towards the Bristol City left. Bakuna with a towering header. James looking to go the long way around. Dickey brought down by the Bristol City centre-back who receives his second booking of the game and Rob Dickey is given his marching orders Naismith sends it long diagonally to Bell who's onside Narky Wells arriving in the middle he's put it wide a golden opportunity both sides and you're thinking there's probably a mistake somewhere is it going to be from Bristol City and lead to Blues extending lead or is it from Blues they're going to kick, kick themselves after doing so well. Bielik has found Sonic. Sonic inside. Jordan James. It'll break for Lukas Djokovic, who surely seals it for Blues in front of a rapturous away end. Djokovic with his second goal in as many games. Blues have a two goal cushion against the 10 men of Bristol City. Djokovic, right place, right time. Blues lead by two goals to nil. You could tell something was coming, and there you go. I think the amount of space that Blues had when the attacking just down that flank there, 
when ball come into the box I think James was the first onto it he's he's took his eyes off it and it's rolled across but there's Djukovic following up and he's calm as anything to slot the ball into the back of the net the big man in the right place for the big moments again for all of Bristol City's dominance in this second half they were bound to leave themselves exposed Sonic the architect Jordan James with the awareness to leave it for the big man who did the rest in clinical fashion but again Blues have worked the game really well never really looked in danger Bristol City had lots of possession but never looked as if they were going to do anything with it and that's it Blues see out a terrific professional performance at Ashton Gate resolute at the back that's three clean sheets on the bounce now Blues remain undefeated at the start of the campaign Blues have conquered Bristol City on their own turf by two goals to nil keep right on Blue Noses